last video I posted, y'all know that the wig that I ordered for my makeover for last week because I am just a girl, it got delayed. But it since 2020 motherfucking two honestly it might have been 2021 bro i got outre perfect hairline dominica uh 13 by 6 hand tied lace wig <sighs> Wait. i'm actually about to like literally go to class so i'm gonna open the wig right quick and then i'm gonna come back with y'all later when it's time for me to install it i'm gonna do the mermaid boho lock wig look honestly i'll be calling this the tiana taylor wig because that's where i know it from i love me some tt if y'all know me y'all know i love me some tt she did this lock wig one day and i said oh bitch pussy Karen, i want to do her uh, this is so pissed so this is her out the net this is the 13 by 6 they talk about it's really a 13 by 6 slash 2 a little bit but you know the horseshoes is casual it come with a hairband um some combs that i probably will be cutting out three of them well i cut out these two i don't care about this one and then it's a breathable cap which means my figure can go through which means it probably won't be that hard for the locks to go through oh wow oh wow oh wow i do want to show y'all but i got my jerry curl on <laughs> i got these locks from Bobby Boss and new locks curly tips and these are 24 inches which is looking like it's a little too long I'm gonna check this out y'all and then I promise I'm gonna go to class I promise I promise I promise I mean they stay longer though they for sure longer I'm wondering if I keep them the length that they are if it would make the wig look like if it would look spaghetti noodle-ish or if it would go because it's not that many of these actually but this is really hot this wig is hot as shit <laughs> Don't say shit about my mannequin. Don't say shit about my mannequin. Don't say shit about my mannequin. I ain't had a wig in two years. You think I give a fuck about? Camille got me this. Why would I replace her? I'm gonna tell y'all what we about to do. So I'm finna to tweet all up and through him. And then after I tweet, we're gonna add the locks. Let me turn my sister to the big. Oh, look at this. This is real juicy, real puss. Wow. Oh my goodness. I'm for James. The ones I put at the top, I'm not gonna have to cut for real, as you can see. It's just the ones I put in like the mid section. I might have to cut a little bit. When we get to that part, I'm gonna show y'all how we're gonna do that part. I'm still trying to sort it out, you know what I mean? Because these are crocheted. I don't have no fucking crochet needle at all. So I just was gonna sew the drones on these little drones. But now because it's like breathable, I might just tie it and then sew it. So it's like a double wing for cham shammy. So we just gonna see how that go, how that go when it go. But we're here for the ride, you know? Boho, mermaid, TT Taylor wig. We here for the ride. This is how the tweezing turned out. I think it looks really good. I'll have to see on my head what it's gonna look like. Cause this lace isn't um like transparent or HD lace, but honestly it's not a problem. I'm brown, she gonna melt. I ain't tripping, I ain't tripping, I ain't tripping. So now we're going to apply the locks. It's kind of hard to film how I put the locks in, so I'm just gonna like tell y'all. So I sew the needle through wherever I wanna put the lock at. This next lock is gonna be going right here. And then I sew the needle through the actual lock itself. And then I come back and I lock stitch it. And that way it's like secured to the wig. And then I'll lock stitch it one more time and then that's it. In this next part, I'm trying to show y'all how I did the locks for the ones that were like in the middle of the wig because they were like a little bit too long. And honestly, it might be a little choppy. I'm going to try to get it to where like what I'm saying makes sense and I'm going to do some voiceovers here. But understand, this is not a tutorial. I'm just showing y'all how we real niggas give it up. But it's not a tutorial. Um, But this is what I did. But it's not a tutorial. But just, okay. I'm taking the lock feeding her through the gap like this okay this is the lock and i'm finding a good length for her to where it matches with the curls and then i am making a knot like if you tie your shoes pull it as tight you can take some scissors or some shears cut off a little bit a little bit at the top so the knot stays knotted and then what you want to do Take your needle and thread, and I'm gonna sew right through that knot. 
and I'm a lock stitch the knot. Okay, now I'm about to show y'all how I did the locks that are right closer to the front one on the lace, but in a different angular perspective. Sew through the lace, and then you want to do a lock stitch. Sew through again. If y'all don't know what the lock stitch technique is, look it up on YouTube. Um, I'm, 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 this is not a tutorial, okay? But you just pretty much wrap the thread around the needle, and when you pull through, it makes a knot, uh, i.e. locking the thread in place, right? If y'all can see the hole in the shade Negro, you're gonna sew the needle through the hole, like so. Y'all can see it. I'm gonna try to zoom in so y'all can see. And you pull it and now the lock is on the thread. And then you're going to do one more lock stitch, okay? And you don't wanna go over the same place several, several times because it could rip your lace, but you don't wanna go too far out because then you could around and shrink your lace okay so we're staying in the relative area but just make sure you're not going in and out the same holes y'all can see the lock stitch that i'm talking about a bit better i'm gonna try to see if i can get it but here's the needle you want to take the end of the needle that's attached to the wig not the one that's attached to the end of the needle just so it's easier to grip it's all the same thread but this is just so it's easier to grip take this in here and go one two three at least three times i'm gonna go five but at least three times, either way it's fine. Five just makes a bigger knot. And then you're gonna pull her down. You see that? She's knotted as far as she could go. And you're gonna cut this. You can cut it all the way at the base. I leave a little something, something. And now you have a fully attached lock. <laughs> Guess who finally finished her wig? Get me! It's real big, yeah. <laughs> so what I'm gonna do first is put on the wig cap. I'm using this, I got it from the beauty supply. It was maybe like $2. Yo, I'm recording for both TikTok and YouTube. So if the camera angles keep switching, that is why, okay? This is difficult. What I just did was use some even to brush back my edges. Now, if you've been on my channel, I've done several videos of me doing wigs. Um, not necessarily finishing them because honestly halfway through I'd be like girl fuck it But I've done several videos of me doing my wigs and no, I do not do the invisible method on my hair I've been trying to do that with the cap, but genuinely I changed my hair a lot So it's sort of pointless after a point point. and then also too. I'm not fucking good at it Literally, I've tried it all of one time and said for what we're just gonna go right on top of my girl um liquid foundation Yes, it's gonna make my braids dirty. Um, no, I do not care. Put some makeup in a port. Ooh, Ooh yeah, girl. Uh huh. Yeah. Mm hmm. You can see the little differentiation from my foundation. This is gonna be real pus. I'm gonna do it one step at a time, no Jordan Sparks. So, really, I feel like I should do like this. Because my actual trajectory of my hair, it'd be like the ear tab area where it'd be a bit more like difficult. And then everything else be fine. I'm gonna put regular glue on my ear tabs. And then I'm gonna do um I'ma do my wonder lace for the rest. I feel like keeping my hair like my wig glued on for weeks at a time when I change my hair entirely too much for that. But also, too, I feel like that would stress me the fuck out. Like, I don't know, like, maybe that's just me, but, like, these bionic glues running down the street, I'm not at that level with wigs yet where, like, well, I wouldn't even say that. I'm just not, I don't feel like I need all that security because I take my hair off way too much. If anything, I feel like I would feel very over by my wig not budging. Like, I feel like that would legit send me into a panic. <laughs> um... But, you know, for the girls that that works for, shout out to y'all. You know, y'all use whatever glue y'all want. I'm going to do three layers of regular glue. And then I'm going to do a layer of the even. This is not a tutorial. Please do not do what I do in the way that I'm doing it. And Like if I told you to do that. If you want to do that, boo, you do what you want to do. It's your head top. And fuck it. If y'all like the results and y'all want to try this, okay. But... If you try it and you be like, damn, like, Angel, this low-key, this shit was not it for my edges. Like, 
Wooty woo ah ah like that ain't for me. I didn't tell you to do that, sister. No, I really didn't. I'm sorry. Okay. I'm about to fucking say because I ain't even this shit, girl. I'm spraying it on top of my cap. Not to really glue the cap down low key, but just so that way um I don't put it too far down on my forehead. Cause I don't know. I don't I feel like I have a regular size forehead. Like I don't got a five head. I'm I, I feel like I have a genuine forehead. Shit, I got a three and a half head. So um wigs can get real low real fast. So I don't really you know, I try not to shy away from putting the glue directly where it's supposed to be. And that's just me. You do what you do for you, okay? If you want your forehead to be shrunk up in that wig, girl, you shrink her up in that wig, girl. I let my hair sit for a little bit blow dried it i ain't let it sit for that long and now i have some thinning shears that i'm gonna use to go through and cut the lace i might fuck around and not record this part because one these thinning shears are sharp and then two i really want to focus because this part be difficult for a young nigga man the reason i use the thinning shear is just because it's really sharp and i felt like it's pretty much like it's pretty much an eyebrow razor, but it's just like a it's a sheer. I'm gonna do this one with y'all and then I'm gonna go to TikTok for the other one. The cast is crazy. I'm gonna try to use some of this pump it up. Gertie's was using Evan or even like the tent and then like doing this. But I don't have that. And also I don't know if they did makeup before doing this part. But I'm gonna just do my best, y'all, because I feel like I believe in myself, but at the same time, she's looking a little, she's looking a little spooky, spooky, yuki, I feel like that helped a little bit. Oh my God. She's in this little elastic, okay? And you see, I got the whites. We, again, we not worrying about that. We doing one thing at a time. We doing one thing at a time, okay? I decided to let the hair sit for 20 minutes um i'm scared <laughs> i'm so fucking out of that i've got this foundation shade that i'm going to use to put the makeup over the lace i meant to buy myself some lace like makeup and then i didn't do it i was just like fuck it i don't need it but now like mm -hmm. The cast is there. I mean, she's stuck though. The girl that I watched, um, I'm gonna tag her if I can find her. But she like puts the makeup on the lace and then does like a finger thing again. Okay, in real life, it's not bad. On camera, it look a mess. But IRL, get me i'm gonna go watch my sister's video real quick before i do any next steps beyond this makeup and i'm gonna go see what she does i have returned from looking at my girl ebay's tiktok i'll put her tiktok information down below because when i tell y'all she eat these wigs she eat these wigs now what i didn't do was look at the video before i did my hair i was putting around freaking about it but and however i just looked at her video she put the makeup on first and then she melted it but i melted it and then did the makeup I'ma just do the pump it up spray again on top of the makeup and then put the scarf on and then that should, God willing, <laughs> that should get us where we need to go because I don't have any darker foundation for real. And in real life, this match is really good. It's just that cast is terrible. If anything, I'll mix up a little darker blend and brush it on top after the second melt, just depending on how that looks. But I'm gonna put a bit more makeup on here before I put the pump it up on there because I don't know, I just feel like I need to do that. And then I'm going to put my band on, okay? And I did 20 minutes the first time. I might fuck around, do 20 minutes again, you know, try to figure me something to eat right quick. You know, we'll do well. <laughs> I'm like real founding fatherish. 
Ooh. Girl, hold on, bitch. I think I done did it. <laughs> hold on, y'all. Hold on. I'm gonna finish. Hold on. Strappers on. I have spritzed. E bye, sister. E bye, sister. E bye, sister. Hopefully, this is it. No Mike Jackson. This is all niggas needed, okay? I have so much spritz on my fucking vanity right now. My fingers is sticky and nasty. The fingers are filthy, the fingers are nasty. I'm gonna let her sit and then we're gonna do baby hair and style her and it will be done. Cause it's been literally four hours. It's literally been 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 four hours. I'm just ready to wrap her up. I'm not really rushing though. I'm excited, I'm having a fun time but it's literally been four hours so all right i'm gonna just go back with this i was gonna try to fake the funk and act like i just did the elastic band off and woo -woo -woo. that's a lot i let it sit for the full 20 minutes but i went to go make me something to eat and by the time i started eating my head literally was gonna start hurting and i said i will not be doing that so i took the fucking bands off okay i cheated i'm here I think I'm gonna do another light layer of makeup and then I'm just gonna go ahead and jump into the edges. Cause you know what, at the end of the day, she don't gotta be perfect. She just gotta be worthy. All right, let me stop fucking playing. It don't gotta be perfect. <laughs> it don't gotta be perfect. It don't, it don't, it don't. I'm not gonna lie, this side looks really good. I'm not gonna hold you guys. This looks really good over here. Ooh. Ooh, this it, girl. <laughs> I already have my baby curlers loading up. So I'm loading up. I have my baby curlies heating up. So I'm gonna go ahead and take out the portion that I wanna use for baby hair. Excuse me, excuse me. Mm -hmm. Already we see her coming together, right? edges are done me think we have this side which honestly this side came out better than this one this didn't really curl all the best so it's giving two different sorts of edges right now um and um, if i can be honest with you i'm not i don't really care that bad i'm gonna flip it on this side because i prefer the edges over here i'm gonna spray some even a little bit and get her flatter Girl, I don't know. She stink a little bit. Ooh, girl, where that burn me a little bit? The only thing I want to do is put some makeup so I can try to disguise the cat. If I can't disguise it, then I'm gonna cure by that. Okay. I'm gonna take spritz. We're just gonna spray it over the whole ordeal. I forgot about this side, guys. Listen, this is where I'm going to go ahead and call her a wrap for today. Um, I might get gussied up and then show y'all pictures of me getting said Gus. I'm going to put on some lip gloss and then we're going to do our outro. Honestly, this hair just keeps getting bigger and bigger and I do not want to keep messing with her. And it's been literally five hours and honestly, I've had it officially so this is the boho locks um this is the lace i say i'm pretty proud of myself if i had melted the cap i feel like this would have been damn near perfect and if i had some rubbing alcohol we can see it's all type product when i wash my face we're gonna see how lacy the lace still looks this looks pretty good to me for the first 13 by 6 frontal um i've ever had for real um have i 
I think so. I've only had like a T part synthetic frontal and like a partial frontal here there. But like ear to ear, 13 by six, this is I think my first go round with Shorty on myself. Cause I've had clients that have frontals before. But yeah, this is that look. I hope you guys liked it. Again, she's flip over. So it's sort of, you know, wherever, however you order. Oh, this, this is, oh bitch. Hold on, this is real puss over here. Whoa. I'm gonna give you guys a full 360 and then I'm getting the fuck ASAP, okay? Now, I don't know if the locks look spaghetti-ish. If so, humbly, don't give a fuck. I love spaghetti. Well, half up, half down. Well, not even a half up. Oh, updo. You know, with some pieces falling. Oh, girl. You see the, ooh. I was taking pictures. Well, really, I was taking some videos so I can screenshot them and those can post as pictures. If you know, you know what the fuck I'm talking about. And I was just like, dang, I look really good. I should probably go to YouTube right quick and show them because every time I get gussied up, I do not turn to YouTube. I be up here talking to y'all because y'all is my friend. I don't be coming up here trying to be cute. If I look cute that day, then boom. But like, I don't go like out my way all the way about it unless I just feel like it. Let me throw this up in a little horny one right quick so y'all can see. Cause this wig is real versatile. versatile. This wig is really versatile. These wigs look, let me see how I look. I look cute, I look cool, right? Right? Point is, you can do a lot of stuff with this wig. I don't know how she look right now, but understand, She's uh, 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 she can do a lot of shit. Thank you very much, thank you very much. I'm gonna take this back off and then I'm done doing that. <laughs> but that is today's video. I filmed a lot this week, so give me time to get things out, but not a lot of stuff coming. I thank y'all so much for watching and staying with you, with your girl. You get me, lot. You get me. Subscribe if you like it here. I hope you like it here. You don't have to like it here. If you don't like it here, we don't got beef. I mean, there's so many different ways to subscribe. Now you can click down below. You can click that little picture of me in the corner. I'm either right here or I'm right here. You get me. You get me. But you can click that little picture, okay, with me and my blob, and subscribe. I can see you more frequently, um, because you'll have notice. Turn those on, please. I forgot to say this, but be kind to others. And at the very least, be kind to yourself because you deserve it. I love y'all niggas. I see y'all niggas. Bye, niggas. Oh.